harvested paddy is unloaded from vehicle. Operation starts with deposition of harvested raw paddy in gorge. Harvested paddy is discharged through feeder elevator to paddy cleaner. The paddy cleaner is specially designed for cleaning unwanted materials mixed into the harvest paddy. Following this, paddy discharge to storage silo. Then it moves to NDT paddy dryer to remove the moisture from paddy. The drying section allows uniform distribution of paddy for uniform drying and quality. Air channels are like an inverted V buffers. One end of each channel is open and the other end is closed. MDT's specially designed copper heat exchanger converts the normal air to hot air, temperature 70 degree to 110 degree depending on paddy moisture. Hot air flows inside the inverted V-shaped buffers for removing moisture from paddy. Hot air flow process repeatedly takes place through MDT dryer uniformly 4 to 5 times depending on paddy moisture. Then paddy moves to storage bin for par boiling process. Par boiling of paddy is a hydrothermal process in which the starch granules within the rice grain are gelatinized by the application of steam and hot water. The tank is fitted with steam distribution system to cook the paddy uniformly. Paddy is soaked in hot water to get the desired result in terms of color and hardness hydration process. The surplus water is drained through automated valve system. Then, paddy is discharged to the belt conveyor. The soaked paddy is filled in to continue cooking process. Gelatinized soaked paddy discharges from the vessel to online cooker through rotary gate. The paddy is steamed automatically with a PLC-based control process system. The system generates safe uniform cooking and even color of rice grain. Paddy moves to bottom discharge gate. The fluidized bed dryer is used to remove water residue and moisture from soaked paddy. Made up of a blower and fluidization chamber, the air blown will pass through the wet paddy as well as fluidize and move the paddy, removing excess moisture. The paddy is discharged to MDT dryer to remove the final moisture. Once again, the drying process takes place inside the dryer. Finally, the dried paddy is delivered to the rice process.